a Winnipeg teenager has shown she has the right stuff. And by right stuff, we mean she aced it in an international neuroscience competition called the Brain Bee. Lisa Way came in second, not so shabby, considering she went up against 25,000 high school students. CTV's Alex Carpa is our reporter of record. And Alex, tell us more about the whiz kid. Sandy, a Winnipeg high school student is one of the smartest in the world when it comes to neuroscience. She finished second in the International Brain Bee competition. For me, it was like, so surprising. It was not expected at all. Lisa Wei, a grade 11 student, competed against more than 3,000 other students from 40 countries. She says the competition focuses on facts about the brain, from basic function to higher levels like emotion and memory. I spend my summer months like learning it, like setting goals, for example, how many chapters or like articles to read per day. And her love for the brain comes from how sophisticated it is. And how such organ can, can simply could simply like lead to extremely complex phenomena such as behavior, emotion and memory and also aspects of learning problem solving. The competition was held online earlier this month. The judges ran out of questions to ask Wei and her Australian competitors since they knew all the answers. Dr. Robert Beatty, a professor in the University of Manitoba's College of Medicine, worked with Wei and says it's a testament to her skill. This competition is incredibly difficult and these questions are postgraduate level and so she's only in grade 11 which is mind-boggling when you think about it, no pun intended. Uh, but she's really just a phenomenal student and it's, uh, we're extremely proud here. BD says Winnipeggers have been successful in the Brain Bee, winning three of the last four competitions at the Canadian level. We're training through this competition the next generation of neuroscientists and next generation of healthcare workers uh, and just instilling that passion for science in these students. The competition is open to all high school students across the country and is an opportunity for students to learn more about neuroscience. The Canadian National Brain Bee will be held in Toronto in May. Sandy? Very impressive. Okay, Alex, thank you.